Greetings, everyone. Michael Stone here. And uh, tomorrow we start our new Way of the Mystic course. I'm really excited about it. Some amazing people coming together. I hope you're one of them that's considering joining us. So it'll be seven sessions uh, plus three uh, coaching sessions on top of it. So basically 10 sessions that will be working with this way of the mystic. As I've said before, we're looking at a cultural mystic as someone who uses everything that happens in their life to awaken uh, consciousness, to be more present. And I just wanted to once again make an invitation, but you know, it's a beautiful day here on the Sunshine Coast, one of the most amazing days, and it's also a full moon today. So um, I was thinking about that as I, as I was looking at the full moon last night about the invisible forces and how much the moon affects us. And we pay so little attention to the impact of it. And we're 90% water, except for the air, of course, which we're 99% air. But um, I just wanted to say that that's what this course is really about, is about determining determining the subtle forces that are influencing us, the the invisible forces like the moon. You know, if you work in a hospital or at the police station, you realize what an amazing impact the moon has on people and how many more um, injuries there are and how many more crimes there are around a full moon. Um, so there are many other invisible forces, which I talked about in the uh, master class, which you can listen to, it's still available, the class on the Great Divide, really moving from the head to the heart, which is what all this works about. One of the things we'll be talking about is the body and being embodied, because this is an embodied approach to personal and planetary healing. And I thought I'd just take a minute for us to really notice our breath. And that's about all I wanted to do tonight. So why don't you join me if you'd like and let your eyes go closed. And let's just tune into our breath. Just notice, well, how am I being breathed right now? Just begin to notice that. And mostly we think of the breath as just the life force, but Actually, it's an amazing tool that we have to tap into our soul journey on a much deeper level. First of all, let's, let's put our focus on the out-breath and extend it. Just breathing in and then really focusing on the out-breath. And with just a few breaths, you can notice yourself beginning to downregulate. To feel your energy body, the energy that's moving. To notice any place you might have stuck breath, pain, or numbness. And then just feel as you just land in your body on the out-breath, how it just puts you squarely in your body and grounds you to the earth. It seems very simple, but it takes practice to just stop no matter what and just down-regulate your energy with the out-breath. Just noticing how your body responds, how it quiets the mind, slows us down, and at the very bottom of the out-breath, 
is really where we touch into that place of stillness. The place where everything waits to be born. And then as you hit that out breath, the bottom of that breath and feel the still point, allow yourself to breathe in and notice how that affects your body. Just taking a few breaths, breathing in. Feeling the relaxation. And then move your attention about three feet above the crown of your head. Imagine that you're just breathing light in from that point. That's the soul point, the place where you breathe in from there, right through the crown of the head, and just imagine that that in-breath is just filling you with ancient light. And then shift your attention back and forth between the in-breath from about three feet above and feeling that light just filling your body. And then the top of the breath, that still point again. And then on the out breath, releasing, down regulating, grounding. Leaving the still point at the pause. And breathing in. Just take a couple more together, recognizing that your in-breath is breathing in the oxygen from the trees, is connecting you with everyone and everything else. You're receiving that light energy. And then on the out-breath, releasing allowing yourself to feel that deep connection, grounding, sense of belonging. And then coming back slowly. It's such a simple thing. It's one of many, many exercises that we'll be developing in the way of the mystic course. So we hope you will join us and uh, enjoy the full moon. It's so beautiful. <laughs>